Lady Mom T. Hey guys, Lady Mom T here, and today we're going to be going through our collection of stuff and putting it up on the wall. So we have these, they're going to stay there, but in here, look, we have Lorne from Angel. He was a great character. And we have David from The Lost Boys. And here's where it gets crazy because we have like a bunch of action figures kind of stuffed in each area. This this part isn't too bad. This one's really bad. Like it's got so many in there you can't even see them. This one, just so many action figures. That shelf's not too bad. The bottom shelf, that'll stay. Um, but yeah, and this isn't it, guys. There's like two bins in the attic full of action figures. There's some in our closet. So we're going to go through them and hang them up on the wall. And I'll show you what that looks like. All right, so I just want to show you guys what we've gotten done so far. Um, these are from the display cases, and we have the late, great Stanley in the center. We have this painting that was done by a friend of ours that we're going to incorporate into this. So here is the first display case. Um, I kept my Tiffany and Woody dolls up there. Well, that, the Woody doll is my man's. Um, he dressed up as Woody for the um, Parade of Lights and <laughs> he looked just like him. Um, and then, if you guys don't know, my name's Tiffany, so I have the Tiffany doll. And we st we kept Lauren from Angel and we kept David from um, the Lost Boys there. And this is from my little Shopkins hauls that I used to do. It's a little unicorn and inside it has an exclusive, like a rare unicorn Shopkins, so I put that there. And then on this shelf, he's got Sam and Bobby Singer um, pop figures from Supernatural. And then he's got Dr. Ian Malcolm from Jurassic Park. And then I got him these for Christmas. Um, they're 24 karat gold um, Star Wars cards. And then... Um, this shelf pretty much stayed the same, and so did the bottom shelf. So this one was really stuffed, and this is what the top shelf looks like. Um, these two were taken out of package because they're just, I don't know, we just decided to oppose, oppose them <laughs> instead. Yeah, that's with the invisible woman. Um, with the invisible woman, um, the two-year-old, like, ninja ripped her out of the package <laughs> and my man screamed like a girl and <laughs> he's like well we'll just we'll just display her now <laughs> the second shelf is a bunch of star wars stuff that couldn't go on the wall We've got jabba or whatever his name is back there um this is i guess the power ranger shelf he just got the green ranger and then that is some nasty critter from the show so all that stuff is my boyfriend's collection. I never collected anything until I got with him. So this is my collection. I have um, a Gulia, like a stand-up Gulia, and then I have a little metal Gulia right there. Um, they're from Monster High, and she was my favorite because you would assume that she's the dumb one because she was a zombie, but she was actually the genius. Um, and then I have Bridget from Trolls, love her, um, and I have Ren and Stimp, or I have Stimpy, and then I have, um, Rocco from Rocco's Modern Life. They were my favorites. Right there, and then my son gave me that pink bear in the background from Fortnite. This is a shield from, um, a Comic-Con that we went to, and then this is like a... Oh, these are from, let me zoom in, these are from the Bates Motel, um, the, if you guys are, ever saw the Bates Motel, um, room one is where he killed his victims, and they had these little keychains um, at a Comic Con, so we bought those, and then this is a dragon sword from um, Power Rangers, that's my man's, I don't know why it's in here. 
And then this is Professor Snape's um, wand. Rest in peace. And then down here I have like this really fuzzy pick me pop. It's huge. Alright guys, so this is the completed Marvel section. We got some old, some new, we got the painting, and we have Wolverine underneath. This is the uh, Star Wars section. Um, it's kind of hard to see some of them. But that's his collection of the Star Wars characters. Then over here, I call this the nerd section. And he has... He has Napoleon Dynamite, Pedro, uh, Kip, and some other dude. Beavis and Butthead. And then over here he has two characters from his two characters from Firefly and Hercules. And this is his favorite section. Rocky. He loves Rocky. He has Apollo Creed. Um, he's got Rocky all decked out in an outfit. <laughs> he has Mick and he has uh, Ivan Drago and this is Rocky when he went to go fight Ivan in I guess Russia. It was an adventure guys. <laughs> Alright thanks for watching.